So I've just done my monthly scroll on Roblox looking for wonderful games like the Ice Spice Obby and then something catches my eyes. Top earning. Pets Go. What in the world is Pets Go? So I click on it and I play it and long story short, it's awful. Who the fool? Now before we start, make sure to like and subscribe since I will do a celebration live stream for 500 subscribers. I'm not sure what game yet. I'm still deciding but that's all about it i have played pet simulator and big games games in the past and pet simulator for a while of it is just an awful gambling mess i don't even know why i played back then but that's because i was a stupid little child now it early shames me how pets go has about 200,000 players concurrent even though they literally stated it took two months to make now i'm purely making this video because i think pets go is just an evil cash grab it is awful pets go is everything wrong with roblox let me just summarize this number one it's a simulator game and as, as we know simulator games is the plague of roblox but even worse than that it's sister rng games now take sugar and spice and everything not nice and then you get pets go gambling rng and simulators it's awful now, how can I obviously criticize something without actually experiencing myself? So, I will go through the mental torture of going through an RNG pet simulator game. So, please like and subscribe for my sanity. Please, please, please. Alright, so straight into the game, I can already see some insane gambling tactics. Bright colors, funny, squishy sounds to keep you hooked in, you know. The satisfying sound of you getting a coin once you roll. You see that? Oh my goodness. Now, one thing about this game is that they like to show odds a lot. So, they use something called the near miss effect here. You are never guaranteed to get any of the things before your actual pet. This is all just an illusion to keep you playing. Now, Pet Sim wants people to play because more playtime equals more people. More people equals more playtime. It's reverse, like, gambler goo effect. I don't even know how to say it. Now, premium players, if a premium player plays this, their playtime converts into real cash. So, of course, they want more playtime. And how do they do this? They use stupid upgrades so faster hatch to get more attention span even faster to get more attention span and then instant to get more attention span and then even worse auto roll so you don't even have to be on your computer to play this game now i might be saying oh it isn't even gambling like you're just doing all these stupid effects and saying it and or just saying it's an awful game of all these squishy sounds all these cute little pets these odds bigger than the name well yes it isn't really gambling because you're not spending money but it's designed to make you spend money look here i could have got that one in 355 pet if i bought more luck let me go to the exclusive shop and double my luck infinitely no joke you can keep on buying this there is no limit and it only lasts 12 hours. A popular Roblox YouTuber, LCLC, actually purchased this up to when it reached 500,000 Robux for one purchase. And I'm not sure if he actually got anything good. I'm, I'm being real. I'm not going to watch that video because I'm, I'm, I've got better things to do in my life. Thank you. But it's just shows to show how scummy this game is. Here's a key fact you should know about how games like this even are allowed on the platform. Is that about 80 to 85% of Roblox like... Player base is under the legal age of gambling. Under 18, 80% of the players. Now, the thing with these game passes, in most Roblox games, they only give you sly advantage or just a cool accessory. You can play the game and succeed as the normal people do, even if you buy a game pass. But with Pet Sim, no, 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 no. You want that huge pet, you have to buy every single game pass until we occasionally slip up with the odds and you get the occasional one or two now it takes anyone above the mental age of 12 to tell that this game is a big no no do not touch the five-year-olds of roblox will not know about this and they'll continuously blindlessly play it and when it reaches christmas time they'll get a robux gift card and ask mummy to spend it on pet rng game now if you've never played roblox and you haven't even heard about what a big game is it's essentially a group on roblox and you're probably asking yourself why is it still on roblox well sit down and listen here it makes Roblox money. A ton of money. The games you see on the front page, that's just all money for them. Because in the DevX program, they take 70%. Not even 50, not even 40. All your hard work, Roblox takes 70 for platforming you. Now, do I respect big games for making a game like this? Mm, no, I, I really don't. That's enough about my like heartless rambling. Uh, I hope you guys enjoyed this video and I love you all.